we would be remiss if we didn't use some of our time today to talk about the athletic side of the program. I know that if we were taking questions, we'd get questions about that. I can tell you that in the 25 years I have done this program, uh, we have consistently had questions about things like stadiums and other things. So let's, let's talk a couple minutes about that. Um, I know there's been discussion about practice facilities for basketball. There's been discussion of uh, facilities for football. Uh, and there's been speculation that there might be groundbreaking in the next uh, several months or at some period of time here recently soon uh, in the in near future. Tell our viewers what we know about that. Well, we, we're, in, we're, in a, we're in a fundraising uh, and, and planning mode right now. The board uh, has uh, uh, received an initial uh, outline of what it is that we'd like to do. It, one of the, another surprise being on the board was really uh, how much attention sports gets. When we hired the new president, I think I got four or five calls, but you know, we change a football or basketball coach out, the, the, the phone is really, really ringing off the hook. Athletics is only 2% of our budget, and it really is, is operated uh, without public money, and it, and it is very close to, to self-sufficient now, uh, taking money from private philanthropy and from media sources so it really runs financially like a like a private uh, private business but it, uh, even though it's only two percent of our budget it consumes it is the door and window through which we operate uh, I do think uh, with the channel even with the challenges that we have it's it's a business that is important for the university from a branding standpoint when Northwestern won the Rose Bowl their annual giving university-wide increased uh, tens of millions of dollars if not hundreds of millions of dollars and so there is a uh, you know there is the there so, is the, so the tell coach rise. kill to get going on this <laughs> well he's he's doing a pretty good uh, he's, he's doing a pretty good job on that but it is it is uh, it is a very very big business that we we you know we, we try to keep in context and uh, the regents don't uh, spend a lot of time uh, on that there's really more important academic uh, oper operational issues going on, and so we uh, we don't tend to over focus on it. Do we have a? Um, uh, we can always make news here, uh, 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 Mr. Beeson. So, do we have a date when groundbreaking might occur on some of these facilities? Or uh? you know, we don't yet. No, we don't yet. We're waiting for a financing proposal and a more completed plan from the administration, and we we uh, uh, that's really all I can. Uh, I can say right now. All right. Well, no news. Well, <laughs> we'll we'll bug you about that later.